Hey everyone, Zero Jada here with the x Fans Channel. I'm here to give a quick taste of Sugar Tanks, a what I feel very low effort tank game. I say that mostly because uh, this is by the same developers who made the Airy games and a lot of the menu issues from those games are present here. So if I actually hit start, there's no, there's nothing actually selected here. Uh, and even if I hit uh, down, it instantly goes to main menu. So if I go to options and then go to audio, you're gonna wonder what it just loaded. It put me into the level that I was sitting on top of, which makes absolutely no sense because that being in a menu should not affect you, uh, your, over, your overworld, overworld options. Uh, also, you may notice that there are enemies. You don't have to kill any of them. The only enemy you really have to kill is the boss. Uh, you do get candy, which you can use to power up your tank and buy new tanks. But there's also candy scattered throughout the world, which it's far less effort to collect that and just keep moving or just kill the boss who's not terribly hard and doesn't shoot the fastest and uh, just buy the uh, upgrades that way. There we go. We completed the level. Also, if you hit start, uh, the game will sometimes... Uh, Wee! See? Also, if you're in game and you hit start, your screen will jitter. But yeah, this is like, and I hate being mean about games. I know they're hard to make. This just feels incredibly lazy and made to just uh, be for gamer score. Uh, all the achievements are tied to beating levels. Uh, none of the levels are incredibly hard, and I and you can bet that they knew that gamers would figure out uh, just don't attack anything and just go as quickly as you can to the uh, the level. And I'm wondering if I check the stats of all the tanks, if the fastest tank is incredibly cheap uh, to make the uh, uh, process even faster. Uh, if you look in the bottom right there, my sh that's how many shots I can do before I have to reload. I got my health in the bottom uh, left there. And there we go. Also, all the m music overlapping itself. So this is the shop with all the uh, different things. So which one... I'm gonna find the one that is the fastest. Is there a speed difference? I'm not sure. Shoots faster. Faster than usual, hates bombs, is a hundred, uh, uh, whatever we call these. Well, I also don't know how to switch. Oh my God, the music overlapping is actually the worst. It doesn't feel much faster, but whatever, it doesn't matter. But yeah, this this just feels super, super lazy and existing only for collecting up gamer score. Also, I'm pretty sound sure the sounds are exactly the same from Tanky Tanks. Like, there's absolutely no reason to kill anything. Like, yeah, they drop candy, but then you just replay a level with a whole bunch of candy in it and not have to do anything. Uh, and the tanks, it's just... Ugh. The fact that the menu option is the exact same has the exact same issues as like their other games where options aren't highlighted until you move the stick and even then the last option is always used it just feels like I don't know what those does do I don't care There I shot stuff I killed something This still feels like music's overlapping. And we're gonna add some more to that insanity. My lord. Oh, there's the boss. All right, let's switch tanks. Uh, hold on. 
That's the one I bought. Also, I don't understand the aesthetic that's going into it. Is it supposed to be like cutesy for the girls or haha -ha cute? I don't, I don't understand what it's supposed to be other than, hey, it looks different. It's a different game. No, no, really, trust us. Maybe this music isn't overlapping. I'm not 100% sure. This is pretty sure the exact same boss arena and that is the exact same boss. And now we reload. And I'm willing to bet that this doesn't get any more difficult. And there are tanks on either side of me. I'm, I let them live because I can avoid them the stupid boss cannot. Hey, guess what? I finished. And for doing that, I get an achievement. I'm not gonna even collect all the candy. I don't care. So uh, for context, uh, the Aerie games uh, all had cheat codes in them where you could just skip levels and get achievements until Microsoft was like, no, you have to stop doing that. So, like again, I know games are hard to make. Even small, simple ones can be hard to make, but this, I just, this is, this is an achievement game. This was made probably with either the same engine as Tanky Tanks or whatever engine they use or system they use for Aerie. Oh, I finally got hit. Wow. And I know I sound harsh. I just... I think it's just exploiting the system to sell low-quality games in mass for achievements. Music changed, though. The background has changed. Tanks are the same, though. Level feels slightly longer. Oh. Still no reason to kill anything though. Nothing actually blocked my path. And here comes the music. Nope, oh, there I am. Nothing makes like a, a conscious effort to try to like lead the target. They just fire and hope you get hit by a ricochet. Maybe I'm just too good. Maybe I'm just too good of a strategist. I don't even, oh, I was looking at, a, at them sideways. I'm like, what are those? They just stole all the marshmallows from uh, Lucky Charms and they stuck them to the backgrounds. Is there a lightning bolt? Marshmallow, I don't... Hearts, stars, and clovers. Blue moons, that's my lucky... No, there is no, there is not a, li a lightning bolt. I am sorry, I made a mistake. All right, everyone, cover your ears. The fact that the camera, yep, off it goes. The fact that the camera does that is amazing. I also like the fact that it does not highlight the tank that I have currently selected. There we go, we're just gonna buy that. And off we go again, this will be the last level, but yeah. Uh, I'm also pretty sure that uh, Tanky Tanks also got a copy paste release as well. And there was like, there's like four versions of them, but this literally looks like this could be one of those levels. I don't know why I'm avoiding the shots. I have lives and whatever. I think it's just the, the menu thing, being having the exact same issues is what gets me. I, again, I don't know why I'm collecting power-ups. I just, just go. Oh no, I'm at one heart left. Oh, 
I'll never make it. Oh, we're gonna die. Oh. I like how they had one last guy there. God, the music overlapping thing and this continual music in the overworld is the worst. I am Zero JD. This is the X-Blade Fans channel. Have a nice day.